You were made to be ruled. He's gonna heave one up! Schlonky donkey, it's hell of a name. Yeah. It will be every man for himself. spots in every wheel of mutt season survive the playoffs boys we made it we had one loss it was a little scary I, I started to get nervous but we clutched it up we went five and one on the season that secures our spot in the playoffs we're two wins away from the super bowl we've got an 86 overall lineup with a lot of dominant players on it let's talk about this squad of course our prestige jamar chase we're wearing the jersey we don't gotta worry about anything here this is one of the best wide receivers in the game. I love this, Jamar. He has been going off for us. At the helm of our offense is Josh Allen. Gunslinger, protected, and gift wrap with Hot Route Master as his X Factor. At halfback, we got Run CMC. Honestly, not my favorite. Definitely not my favorite running back, but hey, he's an 89 overall. Let's not complain. Our prestige tight end, Rob Gronkowski. His vanguard ability isn't getting used much. Bengals playbook has no eye formation, unfortunately, but still a monster tight end. It's a lot of nice receptions for us. Our offensive line is certainly improved. We definitely could work on our left and right tackle and our right guard, but our center and left guard are solid. Defensively for the playoffs, I made a sick adjustment by adding Luke Keekley. So now we have 90 overall Luke Keekley in the middle and then 90 overall Anthony Walker right next to him. They make a nasty linebacker combo. This Luke Keekley has lurk artist. He's fast as hell. He hits hard. It's just such a good we got our prestige Derwin James, 90 overall strong safety. I've never seen him make a mistake, so keep doing your thing, Derwin. Jesse Bates has been shockingly good. Team of the week, 88 overall Jesse Bates. It's been amazing. Jalen Johnson, Antonio Cromartie, and Joey Porter Jr. Not gonna lie, I've seen this Joey Porter Jr. been getting cooked, though. This might be the longest in Wheel of Mutt history that a player has gone without an upgrade. Like a prestige player has gone without an upgrade. Now, I am recording this video a bit ahead of time, so I'm gonna be in Costa Rica for a few days. So if Nick Bosa got a harvest card, I'll shut up. But for now, we're just raw dogging the 86 overall core elite Nick Bosa. This is our squad for the playoffs, boys. Any loss in our season restarts. In season two, I lost in the wild card. It was so sad. So let's not let that happen again. And keep in mind, it's the playoffs. Only two wheel spins, but the wheel is completely juiced. So hopefully we get something amazing right here. <laughs> we do. This is like the year of the divisions. I definitely have gotten AFC West before because I know I've, I've gotten Chiefs on that. I don't think I've gotten AFC North. Bengals are AFC North. It's the Bengals season. Let's go, baby. All right, so we can get any player that is a Bengal, a Steeler, a Raven, or a Brown. I could definitely use a better right or left tackle. Could definitely use a better right guard. This team has a lot of AFC North. I've got Anthony Walker. I've got Jamar Chase. This feels weird to me, but I think I know what I'm going to do. So there's a 91 over... I'm doing it. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm not even thinking about this. So let me walk you through this decision. AFC North, I'm going with 91 overall Mean Joe Green. I already have... Jonathan Allen, who's insane. But Jonathan Allen doesn't get inside stuff. You need a D tackle for inside stuff. This Mean Joe Green's insane. I almost took this Mean Joe Green last episode when I had Legends Jackpot. 93 power moves, 92 block shed. He's fast as hell, and he gets inside stuff, unlike Jonathan Allen. Let's compare them head to head. This is crazy that Mean Joe Green is only one overall higher. He has seven speed faster, five more excel, more strength, same block shed, more power moves, more finesse. Like, how is this only one overall better? This card's insane. I don't ask those questions. All I do is I boot up. He does get under pressure, but obviously I'm going to go with inside stuff here. Inside stuff is the ability. It is a game-changing ability. I can't believe I've gone this long without it, to be honest. My strongest position right now is D-tackle. Honestly, crazy. That is not how I usually play. The very first wheel spin lands us the best D-tackle in the game. A Pittsburgh Steeler. Got a few Steelers. We really have a lot of AFC North on this team. Hey, I don't know. The odds of this giving us something... Actually, no, that's not true. We need offensive lines so badly. Should we get three packs from the store? We just got to pull some decent offensive linemen. This will be really, really nice for us. Dude, I'm going to try a Legends pack. Let's go for it. I mean, I do... Actually, I get three here. I get three here. We'll be able to make this work. John Randall's... 
Richard Sherman. Hayden Hurst. That is not Hayden Hurst. Will Shields. Will Shields is actually an upgrade. I, I guess I'll take that. I'm gonna stay Legends, actually. I'm gonna do three Legends packs. Because if I pull a decent Will Shields or a Gene Upshaw or a Derek Brooks, those all could definitely be used on this team. Junior Seau, Warren Moon, James Connor, and Joe Green, I already have you. And third and final Legends pack. I have a backup tight end now. 79 Shannon Sharp is actually a halfway decent backup tight end. Junior Seau won't help me. Franco Harris is technically an upgrade. Palomalu's not. Those were like incredibly minor upgrades, but they are upgrades. So 81 Franco Harris will come in at fullback. 79 Shannon Sharp is a backup tight end. Actually very, very grateful for that. I could go Hayden Hurst instead, but I definitely like, I like Shannon Sharp better. And then at right guard, we get Will Shields instead of Linderbaum out of position. It's moderately helpful, I guess. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're an 87 overall. Mean Joe Green is added to the defense. That's a huge addition. And on offense, we've got some minor upgrades. We got Will Shields at right guard. We got Shannon Sharp at backup tight end. We got Frank O'Harris at fullback. And we're about to embark on the wild card. And of course, we got the challenge where the challenge wheel is juiced in the playoffs. If I complete this challenge, which we're about to find out, I want to see it first. Ooh, we have never gotten this one. Two plus user TFLs. Now I will be counting sacks for this as well. So if I sack the quarterback, we will count that as a TFL. The only reason I'm doing that is because sometimes my opponents literally do not run the ball at all, but I have to do it manually. So it doesn't matter if my computer Bruce Smith sacks the quarterback. I have to do it with my user. Challenge wheel is extra juiced in the playoffs because not only can I open any pack in the store, but I could also open any pack with training. Right now, the mystery pack is 2,200 training. Low Key, I might go for that. There's also the 82 plus overall all Madden. I could hail marry it for a 91 or an 88. And then there's the 83 plus most feared player pack, the most dog shit pack uh, in existence. Survive the playoffs. Our team could not be more ready than they are right now. I'm nervous, but let's get it. Jamar Chase, a new addition to the top three. Mean Joe Green and our user, Luke Keekley. He's got Eric Berry, Jalen Ramsey, and Prime Time. Low key, when I see teams that aren't that good, but they're in the playoffs, that shit scares me. Tell me why this bum D tackle is in and not. Jonathan Allen. All right, we got to make a substitution. He's got RG3 in the backfield. Got a couple different slant routes. Nobody's home. Guess who is? Why is he my best defensive player? That Bruce Smith came out two months ago. Second and 23. He's probably looking 87. Fuck. Fuck. Got it all back. Let's go with the blitz. I might be able to get a user TFL right here. Oh no, I can't get on RG3. He finds Mayer once again. Gonna go Tampa 2 now. I don't want to get shot by anything. Short! Where are you throwing? Third and three. He wasn't ready for the Tampa 2. I'm going with the Blitz. Get home! No! Oh, they're going to animate it for that ball, but I don't know what happened. I'm gonna go man up Derrick Henry. Wow. I can't believe he's completing these, bro. I'm dog shit right now. Oh! Nice route. This is the slowest, most methodical drive, but he used an entire five minutes. We just got to get the stop. Huge opportunity. Huge opportunity. Late breakup. He just threw it a pit. Didn't get the interception, but we're, 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 we're here. We got two QB spies. We got a lot of zones on this field. He's got the left side. Yes! It's a Lucamani! Finally makes his mistake. Can we wiggle him out? Oh, the defense. I could have made a more aggressive move there, but let's go. He went eight plays, 74 yards, and he choked it right then and there. He got all the way down and choked it. All right, first and 10. Now we cook, boys. I definitely had something to throw there. I think I just, I just bitched out. I'm just gonna go CMC. I'm gonna keep this simple here. Third and six. All right, Matt, let's fucking, let's play ball. Tyreek! Huge catch. It's fourth and one. I'm no huddling. I'm going inside zone CMC. Believe. Believe. CMC. Let's go. See, I wanted him to. Ooh. Ooh, Gronk. What are you doing out there, Gronk? He might be guessing. Oh, he is. He's guessing pass. He's guessing pass. I don't get I don't get 10 yards like that if he ain't guessing pass. He probably expects the exact same thing, so now we're gonna pass. Okay. 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 Dude, the juke, the juke move is so fluid this year. Patience. I love how 79 is legitimately blocking nobody. This is so ridiculous. Oh! Oh my god! Come on, CMC, punch this shit in. Let's go. 
Let's go! No, that dive. I bet my first dive was so good. That dive was stupid. We do have a momentum factor. If you look in the bottom right, hold the line. Away team has improved blocking. That ain't bad. Second and goal. Let's see if it helps us here on the stretch. Trying to get inside of Eric Berry. And that was Franco fucking Harris. Oh my God. CMC was so tired. He got subbed out. And the Franco Harris we just picked up got a touchdown right there. We got to get a power back next season. Let's see what he's got this time. to whip out a run play. Hasn't done many of those. In fact, that was his very first. Okay, Anthony Walker is here. Does he run it again? I want to get a TFL. I hope so. Oh, let's go. Are we counting that a user TFL? I switched on, but I think he kind of made the play by himself. I can't count that. No, it's got to be like, it's got to be from who I'm usering at the start of the play. Like I'm usering Keekly. Nice ball. Throws it quick. Oh my God, Jesse Bates. Hey, good hands though. Good hands. Way to break that up. Inside the two minute warning. I got to get a TFL. I can't get a TFL like this, but I can get an interception. Anthony Walker with the hurdle. Getting flagged out by OBJ. Can't catch him for him. Let's go. Let's go for two, man. Let's go for two. Let's get weird. Oh, I got, I got time. I got time for Josh Allen. No. I tried to step up. That's all right. That's all right, dude. What, what a healthy lead. I'm not going to complain about this. Is Luke Keekley going to get another car? That's the question. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Is he going to outrun Derwin, too? Was I in the Tampa 2? Through that, through that wheel route on the Tampa 2. Nice play, man. We have this boxed. We have this fucking boxed. Oh my god, I had that too! And then I, I peeled to the second. I'm such a fraud. I should've just... What am I doing? Still Tampa 2. Dude, I'm telling you. Shit. I'm tempted to pick this up with CMC. We've been really consistent in the run game. Third and three. Let's do it. Let's just pick this up. Put that upfield. Oh my god, the run game. I throw underneath the CMC, snags it. Let's go no huddle. Oh, can his user get there? No, but Malik Hooker can. I threw that late. Fuck. I gotta get this. Nice. I threw that so late. I had it. Kingley! One TFL. User sack right there. Massive play. Second and 17. He expects the same thing. Go 87. Go 87. Go 87. Go 87. Get home. Third and 26. I'm running the ball too well to be doing this dumb shit. Honestly. He's not in field goal race. So now he's, he's got to go. Hail Mary here. Best case scenario is just sack. Actually, best case scenario is an interception. Correction. We get a good chunk of the momentum bar for him going for it there. Because that's considered a turnover since I think that was fourth down. Okay. 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 Let's settle down. I'm just done being a goofball, bro. I'm done being a goofy goober. Tyreek! Tyreek Hill! Massive return! That's, oh, that's huge. All right, we're going to attack the teeth. Let's go right at him. Let's go right at him. Follow your block, CMC. He's got inside. Let's go, Jamar! Let's go, Jamar! Six for nine, 69 yards. All right, throw one again. Country road. Oh, no, it's user. I'm actually like that. Oh, I'm really like that. Come on! Oh, he, he took such a good angle, but he switched off. He switched off to let the CPU make it, and we were able to bend that. Oh, that's nasty. I might be taking my hole deeper, but actually, this is free as free. The five-minute quarters is one of my favorite things they ever did. It is so much harder to cheese. You can't just clock cheese. There's too oh, my God. This game is over. He just he threw two to Anthony Walker. Going to the edge. Oh my god, CMC. I'm so sorry for everything I said, bro. I'm so sorry. Burn a little clock here. Let's be extra smart. This is the this is the playoffs, right? I can. Can we do something with this? This isn't a superstar O line or anything. We're just good. Oh my god. Franco. Steve Hartman. Just to be a dick. Just to be a dick. Why does Franco Harris have two touchdowns? And why are we getting red in the playoffs? Dude, that was scary for a second. That game was 13 to 8. Now, we do need to count that game because it is the playoffs. But most importantly, that's a rage quit, baby. What do you got? What do you got? It's an 86 choice. So our choice of any 86 overall player, definitely going to fill a hole on this defense here. Or apologies, I'm going to fill a hole somewhere on this team. I don't know where quite yet. Defensively, if I were to get an 86 overall, it'd have to be an outside linebacker because every position is higher than 86 other than my outside linebacker. But I haven't, like, I haven't noticed. I haven't noticed Taki Taki or Quay Walker doing anything that shouldn't be geeked about. Franco Harris just had a hell of a game as an 81 overall. I'm tempted to go get his. Big boy card. I think what we really do is we get a, is we get a right guard. I think I'm going to get a left tackle. 
tackle. I'm gonna get Trey Pipkins out of here. The fact that he's out of position kind of kind of freaks me out a little bit. Probably the best tackle of all time. One of the best tackles of all time. Trent Williams, 86 overall left tackle. Super well-rounded stat. That's our guy right there, baby. We also did not complete our challenge, but he also didn't give me an opportunity to complete my challenge. Maybe I, if I don't pull anything, it doesn't matter, right? But I could pull some sauce here. Junior say I was a big no as far as sauce is concerned. Same with Michael Strahan. That's a bummer. Franco Harris, I already have you. And all right, see, that's what I get. What I get for trying to finesse. So next game is the NFC Championship. So I'm not guaranteed. I'm feeling good right now. So if I were to prestige, if I make the Super Bowl, Trent Williams is on my radar. Luke Keekley is on my radar. Kayvon Thibodeau is on my radar. Guys, I forgot to make an outro for this episode. I love you. Your cock is long. Have a great day.